Okay guys, definitely on the right track. It just is freaking cold and my hands are all red so... Okay guys, so we made it inside the castle. We just have to go through a security check. This is the St. Vitius Cathedral and we're gonna get ourselves inside. And after that we're gonna go and see where do they sell the tickets so we can go in the palace. Your student card if you're a student. You can get discounts in most of the attractions. That's right, if you're a student or somebody under 26 years of age, you're gonna have a lot of discounts here. Unfortunately, unfortunately that is not my case, <laughs> but it's his case and he forgot it. So, we got the tickets, we're ready to go in the same Vitus. Everything went smoothly and quick, all because we got here early. So, let's just come inside guys. It's so impressive in here. <laughs> Definitely way bigger than what it looks from the outside. For those of you who don't know, this is also a burial ground for many, many, many people, including kings, monks, and relevant people from the Czech Republic and the Bohemian uh, Kingdom. If you guys are wondering, that is the tomb of the Queen Maria Teresa. If from outside it looks impressive, let's imagine inside. Off to the old royal palace. The old royal palace, pretty sweet, however it's on the renovation so not much to see, but it's bigger than what they let us see, that's for sure. Anyways, now we're off to the actual current royal palace where the president lives, let's find it out. over a thousand years that's all this is it was a uh, st. George Basilica and now we're gonna try to get into a royal palace although we are inside the complex I can tell you that it's huge huge massive in the torture chamber of some place in the palace. What's the name again of this place? Gold Laneway or something? Golden Alley, we're in the Golden Alley and it's completely medieval. Yes, you're gonna see. Just check it out. Holy shit. That's painful. Imagine you sitting there. Can't sit there. This area here is just an exhibition of how people in the medieval ages were living. The medieval prison. Let's take a look at it. The royal palace, we might have found it, but there's no type of sign anywhere, so we're just wandering around. Such thing as getting into the royal palace. You have two palaces, Rosenberg Palace, and then you have uh, the old royal palace. That's it. So I think we exhausted our ticket. 
and there's nothing else for us to do here. It's gonna go to the city now. That is disappointing.